Hi everybody, welcome again. In this tutorial, we'll talk about the Vortex cash flow calculation. So let's go. Uh, here is the data. Uh, the company has working interest of uh, 100%, which means that the company uh, has 100% uh, of uh, sharing in OBEX and CAPEX and the revenue. Then we have initial production rate of 20, uh, 200,000 barrel per year. And we have uh, decline rate of 20% effective yearly. And then we have royalty of 25% uh, of revenue. And we have a uh, federal tax rate, which is equal to 20% of taxable income. And the oil price is about $30 per barrel. And the operating cost variable is $5 uh, per barrel. And fixed operating cost is equal to 20,000 barrel per year. And we have a capex of $5 million. And we have a depreciation scheme uh, declining balance uh, of 20%. And we have a discount rate of 10%. So let's start with calculation. First thing, we will calculate production forecast using exponential uh, decline, uh, using uh, this uh, decline rate of 20%. So uh, second year forecast will be equal to 200. And we'll make it fixed, multiplied by 1 minus decline rate of 20%. And we'll make it fixed power to the year number, which is equal to one. And we will copy that down. Then we have oil price of $30. So we'll make it exit. And we will just copy it down. Then we will calculate revenue, which is equal to production multiplied by oil price. So the first year revenue is equal to $6 million. Then we will calculate what's called the reality, which is equal to revenue multiplied by the percentage of uh, revenue, uh, uh, reality, which is equal to 25%. Then we will calculate operating the variable uh, cost, which is equal to operating the variable per barrel, which is 5, multiplied by the total production, multiplied by our working interest, which is 100%, and we we'll make it fixed. And we just copy down. Then we calculate the total operating cost, which is equal to the variable operating cost plus the fixed operating cost. Then we will calculate what is called operating income, which is equal to revenue minus royalty minus total OBEX. Then we will calculate what's called the tax cash flow. And this will equal to the operating income minus the CAPEX. Then we cum our before tax cash flow. And this year will be equal to the first one. Second year will be equal to the first one, the last second one. And we copy down. And we show them in cash flow diagram. We have two curves here, the undiscounted cash flow, which we calculated now for tax cash flow, and uh, the after tax cash flow discounted, which will make uh, through the course. Then we have some calculated indicator, which will, uh, will be in, uh, introduced in the course. And finally, we will go through a sensitivity analysis. So if you are interested uh, to, to make uh, the economic model, please join us in uh, Bayer platform uh, for Petroleum Economics course on uh, 13 or May. Uh, so thank you and uh, see you there.